Hey, how you doing? Brian Kane, your Peak Performance Coach here. And I wanna share with you this Monday one of my favorite stories of all time. It's about being a finisher. And more people need to finish what they start. More people need to be a finisher. It's one of the things I hear most when I go around the country and work with, with teams and coaches, athletes, organizations. They say, we want our teams to be able to finish. Well, in the 1968 Mexico City Olympics, the last event was the marathon, the men's marathon. And the event had been over for two hours. All the reporters were packing up their gear, getting ready to leave the arena. And all of a sudden, one last runner, one last finisher came hobbling into the arena. It was John Stephen Aquari came hobbling into the arena, blood on his knee, bandaged, limping in. He crosses the finish line, gets down on his hands and knees, kisses the ground. Well, naturally, some of the reporters that were on their way out came running over and they said, Sir, sir, who are you? The marathon has been over for two hours. What are you doing? So my name is John Stephen McQuarrie. He said, where are you from? He said, I'm from the island of Tanzania. The marathon's been over for two hours. Why are you still running? He looked down at his knee, bandaged, bloody, hobbling in, he had been injured. He said, my country, sent me 5,000 miles, not to run the marathon, but to finish. What's the marathon you need to finish? What are your goals for this year, this quarter, that maybe you haven't finished? But now is the time. Stop counting the days and start making the days count and be a finisher like John Stephen Aquari. Get after it, get it done, you can thank yourself later. Be a finisher, thanks for checking out this Monday message.